doing that without being there. What do you have to say about the 20, uh, 20 shooting? Yeah, in they can kill our children and say that we should not mark the memorial. Well, I'm I'm Since 2020, October 20th rings a bell in the ears of Nigerians all over the world. On this day in history, the entire country was pushed into mourning following shootings at Lekki toll gates allegedly carried out by the Nigerian army to stop angry Nigerian youths who were protesting against police brutality across the country. It was gathered that about 6.50 p.m. on October 20, 2020, the Nigerian army officers allegedly opened fire on unarmed protesters who gathered at the Lekki toll gate, leading to the death of several unsuspecting citizens. After the incident, there were several controversial stories on the number of casualties at the venue of the protest. However, the judicial panel of inquiry and restitution at the Lagos Court of Arbitration was charged with investigating the toll gate shooting in Lagos. And on Monday, November 15, 2021, in a report that took more than a year to produce, the panel accused Nigerian army officers of having shot, injured and killed unarmed helpless and defenseless protesters without provocation or justification while they were waving the Nigerian flag and singing the national anthem and the manner of assault and killing could in context be described as a massacre. According to the Lagos State Judicial Panel of Inquiry on Restitutions for Victims of SARS-related Abuses and Other Matters, at least 46 unarmed protesters were either shot dead, injured with bullets, or assaulted by security forces at the Lekki toll gate on October 20, 2020. It is exactly two years down the line, and many citizens believe victims of the toll gate shooting are yet to get justice. Many came out in their numbers on Thursday morning with blood-stained Nigerian flags at Lekki toll gate in Lagos State to commemorate the second year memorial of the NSAS protest shooting. So this coffee is all day. More carry this coffee, more carry them go to bed. These coffees are very symbolic. Now here where they kill our people. So we go throw this coffee for them, make them get out, now them get out. So more carry this coffee, no problem for the coffee now. Let's go, let's see the rock. We go only die. In what can be described as very emotional, a survivor of the Lekki Tollgate shooting came out to mark the two-year anniversary of the sad moment noting that he narrowly escaped death on October 20, 2020. He was, however, seen dragged by Nigerian police officers. This is great. This is great. Not so many young men. I was among those that could have been killed. Yeah, that's very good. Is this your name for us My name is Jacob Desmond. Why is it? I get so emotional because I should have been among those that should have died that day. It is two years since the ugly incident, and many Nigerians are still asking for justice and demanding an end to police brutality in Nigeria.